Hi, it's Ben Brick with Cobalt Banker Paradise Real Estate here in sunny Vero Beach, Florida. And I wanted to share my story with you on how I moved here from Connecticut. I had been to Florida many times, but my first time here was in December of 1989. My in-laws had purchased a condominium, so that was our first time here. Subsequently, in 1990, my wife's grandparents purchased a condominium here as well. So we would visit this community two to three times a year. What I really fell in love with was, for example, the orange juice. It is the best orange juice anywhere in the world. Um, we also fell in love with the beaches, 26 miles of unspoiled beaches where, where everybody can have access. Um, a beautiful half mile boardwalk, JC Park, that's lit at night and you can walk it. Um, where I came from in Connecticut, access to the beaches was really restricted. Certain towns only had town beaches. And there were, from where I lived in Connecticut, there were really only three beaches that the public could go to. That was Rocky Neck State Park, Hammonasset Ocean Beach, or I was lucky enough to live near um, Mesquamica, Rhode Island. But even in the summer months, you would have to leave your house at like six o'clock in the morning because there was so much traffic to get there and you'd have to pay to park. Our beaches are all open to the public. There is no parking. Um, with tea Botanical Gardens, the, the foliage and the plants and the vegetation are just the finest that you see like in the Caribbean. I never saw parks of that caliber back home in Connecticut. So this was just an ideal community. We've fallen in love with it for all those years of coming down. And then in 2002, when my in-laws decided to move here, uh, I looked, I talked to my wife about it, and my in-laws were very close with my son. Uh, my son at the time was five years old, and it was only a natural for us to move to this community. And um, we moved here in late in the fall of 2002. And what happened was, um, ever since then, it's been 18 years, we'll be in the fall, and it was a great community. My son went to St. Helens Catholic School, and then he went on to John Carroll Catholic High School, and now he's a teacher at John Carroll. The community has been wonderful. Um, all the people in our church have just been wonderful. We've created so many life lifetime friends, and it truly is a great community, and, it, and it's unique in all of Florida because it doesn't have the traffic and the congestion. On our, on our beaches, we only have two high rises. So if you are looking for a relaxed, laid back community, this is it.